So today I'm going to make, um, I call it the veggie pepper soup. It's not your basic pepper soup um, recipe. I just like wanted to work it up a bit so that we can have more nutrients in our pepper soup. So you can use any meats you want, any part of chicken, turkey, beef, organ meats, shrimp, fish whatever you want and then I have um, I have my vegetables here this is the yellow zucchini or virgin the green one and this is called lake I don't know what it actually is they just look like big sizes of um, onions you know and this one is parsley. This is parsley. This is uh, celery. This one here. And this one is spring onions, the green onions. Now, it's not about what you see here. Use the vegetables that are readily and easily available in the country where you are. My recipe, you don't have to follow it word for word. It's just to give you an idea. To inspire you to create something in ketogenic we're always looking for ways to create new diets get new ideas eat healthy and these are my um, my spices my ginger my complete seasoning salt adobo pepper uh, pepper soup seasoning but pepper soup seasoning is optional you don't have to use it if you want if you don't want to So I am going to start um, with my pepper soup seasoning. I'm just going to do a little bit, half, uh, let me just say a teaspoon. But if you don't have that, you can use black pepper or you can use what uh, they call um, Uziza seed in Nigeria or you use black pepper. You don't have the pepper soup uh, seasoning it doesn't really matter this is not your everyday pepper soup my ginger one tablespoon one teaspoon salt to taste i always like using sea salt My crushed pepper. I forgot you can also use um one tablespoon of crushed pepper. You can also use bell pepper if you want. You can add bell pepper to give it color. The different um colors of bell pepper. You can use it too if you want. Adobo seasoning. That one is like a teaspoon and a teaspoon of my complete seasoning. I pour in enough water to cover it. This recipe is just a basic recipe, something you can just put on the fire and go your way. Like I have the uh, the meat boiling, uh, cooking. I'm going to allow it to cook until it becomes tender. Then we'll come back and do the next step. This is our the meats, the different types of uh, meats and see uh, food that I bought my shrimp. And then as you can see. Most of this meat is lean. There is no fat on it at all, at all. So I'm going to add five cubes of my beef um, talon or lard. It's just fat from beef, and I melted. So I add, I'm adding five cubes. 
so that I can add um, fat into this cooking. I'll allow it to melt, then I'll add the vegetables. So like I said, you can add any vegetable you want. The vegetable that is available in the country where you are, any part of the world, you can add any vegetable you want. Your ogo, your spinach, Nigerian spinach, kale, uh, what is it called? Saint leaf. You can add any vegetable you want. I'm going to taste it for seasoning. That's okay. I'll turn down the lights and then let, allow it to simmer for a bit. So my um, vegetable pepper soup is ready. 